Hello. I am going to talk about culture like a table topic. And honestly, what I'm about to tell you, most of you probably will not agree with me. But since this been in my mind for many years, I thought I'd make a video and hey, maybe it will spark some type of conversations with yourself and others. Okay. So culture is regarded to many people is very important. I agree to a certain extent. Okay. Um, culture. The word culture, you see the first four letters, C-U-L-T, cult. And I don't know if that um, intentionally was made that way, but cult is sort of what I'm hitting at when I'm listening to people defend their culture so much. And I'm not saying they shouldn't, but I think a lot of people are putting culture as if it was God or religion. Okay? So, culture has a lot of old ideas. Okay? A lot of old ideologies. And belief systems and some of them or many of them can be beautiful but have you ever sat down and thought about that some of these things are hindering us okay um, why everyone talks about the old days the old days were better the old days were better the old days had some really fucked up things too. Okay, when you go all the way back to even the most so-called primitive people, if you say, hey, I love your time travel, you go into a tribe that's indigenous to that land. And I'm definitely not picking on any people from a specific land. I'm just giving an example. Hey, I wanna, I wanna learn about, learn about you. I wanna know. I wanna hang out with you. I wanna get to know you. What will you find out? What you will find out isn't the prettiest picture you thought it would be. Okay, so take, take in consideration, there were always wars, okay? There were not all nations, but there were sacrifices. There were set of beliefs, there were cultures Do that make them right, right? Think about it. So what I'm saying here uh, I think all cultures need an update I think um, is, is it safe to say that Japan did that well okay so kind of if you think about the samurai for many years everyone was afraid of the samurai in uh, in Japan, according to some people from Japan, and by the way, the romance thing about the samurai. There are people in Japan that believe that those guys wasn't like the movies. They weren't cool. They weren't cool and just they weren't gonna sit with you and chill with you and be cool with you. Many were bullies. 
if we time travel to them, hey, hey, you cool. I love that sword. If we translate that to English, you be like, fuck you. I'm going to fuck you up. Get the fuck out of here. So this is what I'm trying to tell you. But anyway, so there was a thing with uh, the samurai and the new ways of combat, right? And basically, the Japanese, the more up to date, they found a better strategy. So if they would have stick to the old ways of just the samurai, Japan wouldn't be the way they are. I'm just giving an example. I'm not an expert on history, okay? And there's a number of different type of things like that, um, like uh, martial arts, for example. Old traditional martial arts. You have karate. You have um, kung fu. It looks beautiful, but actually, just a regular a guy that practices boxing could beat them. We learned that. And so think about MMA. Okay, they're striking with their legs, they're punching, they're grappling, wrestling, jujitsu, they they adjust it to become better. And this is can this can be applied to culture. So when people say and sit down and say, no, it's my culture, I, no, 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 this is my culture. Think about it, man. We can right now we can change our culture for the better. I don't believe it has to be that deep. I don't. You can sit down. We can sit down amongst whoever. See what does it work, right? If, if something hasn't worked for years and years and years, more likely that shit ain't going to work. It won't ever work, okay? So we can cross that out. Try something different. Adjust, adapt. Maybe you don't have to be like uh, this group of people here, but you can take some things from what what you see that work for them and add it to your toolbox. You know. So I'm 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 talking about, and I'm not going to say any specific group. I, I don't want those arguments. People get really sensitive about this, but any culture can adapt and become better. So um, it's sort of like being a so-called hood. And I hate that word. I hate it. It's a neighborhood. If you go in those areas, you notice people, uh, this is this example. So maybe they like to fight, like to prove how they manly they are. Okay. Let's get a boxing gym there. Let's get put that energy into something that's more productive. And then you got the kids working out. They're no longer shy. They know how to take a hit. They know how to punch back and punch more effectively. And uh, they can, you know, it's, it's, it's fun. And maybe they can go pro. They can make money 